My name is Ian Davenport and I'm a UK-based artist. I've created an art special for Swatch called Wide Acres of Time. I try and make paintings which are about my response to the world. I'm trying to sort of figure out the world, but I do it through a visual means. You know, I'm really interested in the response that people have to colour in particular. The way that I'm making paintings at the moment is lines of colour have been poured down a surface and they puddle and pool at the bottom, so it's almost like a kind of multicoloured waterfall or something like that. So the painting I've made for Swatch Faces 2017 is a, a real whopper. It's 14 metres long and nearly four metres high, which is exactly the size of the end wall of my studio. So it kind of, it was a <laughs> serendipitous moment when we kind of just were looking at how big we can make something. I think it's really important in that Giardini Park to have something that's of a significant scale because it's competing with trees and foliage. It sort of needs to have quite an impact. So that was one of the reasons for making the work of that size. Timing is, I mean, as well as being important for, for watches, is really important in my work. The, the paintings are almost kind of like an electronic beat. Each line is poured and its control on each line is sort of timed almost, and each line sort of feels like a kind of moment, this sort of repetitive rhythm. I play the drums a lot, so I'm really interested in rhythm and how that connects with music, but also then connects back into art. So to be asked to make a watch for an iconic brand like Swatch is really exciting. And when you think about watch design, it's, that, it's the face which is the key element. The actual process was we poured lines of paint onto a watch shape from, from both sides and we kind of framed off this area here so the paint was kind of pulled into the middle and we drilled a tiny little hole and allowed the paint to then kind of pull down and flow down that hole. It sort of takes a watch into a different place, but it takes my work into a different place. And it's also made me really think about maybe the next um, way, you know, next body of work that I want to do in my work as well. So at its best, I think when you're when you're working on these projects, it can push you into a slightly different area that you hadn't anticipated, which is great. That's what you're looking for.